Hey there, good morning, girl with MS. It's been a while, hasn't it? Well, as you can see, it is still fall here in Southern California. <laughs> the leaves are dropping tremendously. It's absolutely beautiful. I guess I say that a lot, but it is the last of our fall and we'll get some more rain and colder weather, but it is nice. Um, how are you guys doing with the holidays? You know, there's kind of a lot going on, a lot of commitments. I definitely let my MS get to me the other night. I probably should have had a cane with me. I was at a holiday party and I got the wobbles and I looked really drunk and I was not and I was just not myself. And it's really amazing, you know, I mean, you have to every day wake up and say, what can I actually do today? What am I capable of? Um, your agenda cannot dictate your life when you have MS, as much as I hate to say it, because I love being someone who makes a commitment and is considered reliable, and I'm not that person anymore. I've gotten very flaky with what I call flaky with my MS, because I've had so many times to turn things down, to say, I just can't do it. And that's hard for people like us. Most people with MS are go, go, doer, doers, you know, and here we have to say, no, I can't. <sighs> but if I can just keep managing that battery, <laughs> I know I hit on this every day, but it's managing that battery, you know, what's important, what work can I get done, what's causing me stress, what can I just check off the list. I've gotten stuff done this week that's been on my list for 30 days, and to me that's just too long. And I'm, and I'm getting ready for the holidays, too. I'm doing some Christmas shopping, holiday shopping. I'm getting in the spirit. It's fun. Um, feeling good. Feeling, I say that, I'm feeling good about a lot of things. But there's also a little kind of a tinge of, of depression, um, maybe sadness. Um, I have my family around me. I have my friends. But my companion of five years passed away a few years ago. And that's still that's still hard. He was a very special person to me and that's very difficult to deal with at times. You know, you, you lose best friends and you gain best friends, you know, new friends, old friends, but it's difficult. So that probably has me down a little bit more than I thought it would. Um, but I'm, but I'm feeling good. Had a good night's sleep last night. Didn't feel very rested this morning, but I know I had a good sleep, had some of those dreams that you don't really want to leave. You know, they're just happy dreams. You wake up and you're like, oh, let me go back to that dream. I love it. Oh, well. So this is my morning. I hope you guys are having a good morning. I'm getting ready to go do a little bit more Christmas shopping. I um, already did some design work and some programming on the computer, so I've been up and at it for a couple hours. And I'm um, getting ready to do some more projects and just bring on the holidays and the family cheer, the friends, the good times. But take it easy and be easy on ourselves. I've got to keep reminding, reminding myself of that. Limits, life, life with MS. But you know what? It's all doable and we're here and we woke up this morning. That's the most important thing, waking up in the morning. So have a good one, you guys. Talk to you later.